Hi, my name is Emma. I'm Jonah. I'm Noah. And I'm Paige. And today we're going to be doing 10 strange back to school items. Here we go from least weird to most weird. And hit that subscribe button so you can see a lot more of them. So our least weird item is a thinking fidget pen. It's like a fidget spinner, but not as loud. And not banned. So if your school is banned fidget spinners, then you can probably get away with this for your fidgeting needs. This doesn't have a clicker. Person does. It doesn't have a clicker. No. What kind of fidget what? pen is this? What kind of fidget pen is this then? No. You can do this with this. You can stick it on the top and spin it. What type of fidget thing is this? Beautiful. It's good, actually. Here's what are you gonna write, Emma? Give me an equation. You know what face I'm thinking of? Yes. Draw Quran. That is good. I think that's the best part. You can swallow those balls. Don't do it. It seems organs will stick together. Yeah. Yep. Do it. No, no. That'll be why this gets banned. It's a choking hazard. <laughs> so be careful. Oh, you can. Yes. <gasps> wow. Ooh, I like that. Um, you can like. Whoa, you can stretch the entire pen. So moving on to number two. This wait, wait, is beautiful. Wait. I give it a thumbs up. This one, this one's good. I give, it, I give it a seven out of ten. It's it the would least be a nine. It's the least weird because it's a really practical item. Yeah. So number two, we have lunch bags, lunch and these bugs. ones have oh oh my gosh, I didn't read the lunch bugs. That is that is a horrible pun. Anyway, so <laughs> you've probably seen this on Facebook or Pinterest. Yeah, something like that. So these are sandwich bags that have oh. bugs on them. And it actually looks pretty gross. I would want maybe like a nice little mealworm on it. Or like a cockroach. <laughs> no, like no, a this is a cockroach. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say, cricket. I forgot the yeah. name. That's a pretty good bag. I thought that they would be super small. Put trail mix in it. I think that you could actually use this. If you have your food well, in like the office fridge, nobody's gonna wanna take it. They are sorted. We more. have, so we have learned that they are assorted. They're just, Whoa. they're just in a way, this way we didn't know they were assorted. See, look. So we have horse flies. Oh, I like that one. Why? That looks good. This one's probably, this one would fool me. Yeah, that one's pretty me too. All right, so this next item is bouncy bands for elementar chair blue support pipes. Elementary. El it's elementar. elementar. It says elementar it does. on it. It does. It does. It's like a band that you put on the bottom of your chair. And you can bounce on it. And you can bounce on it if you like. It also doubles as an exercising thing. No. no. There was someone, shouldn't someone Landon. have 30 feet? Landon should try it. Yeah, someone with a Landon, you do it. Sit down. Bounce on it. Well, don't stand on it. Just, just like, bounce your foot. Do you like it, Landon? Or does it seem stupid? This is, this is actually pretty fun. Uh, it's like a bouncy uh, park. I have left to say about it. It's, it's like a trampoline park. Let me on there, boy. It's like when you bounce your legs. Yes, it's just I'm like bouncing it. your legs. Or like, if you're nervous, you can move your legs a lot. I like it. Yeah, it's pretty satisfying. It'd be yeah. gross with people with flip flops because you know what they do, they like, do this with their and, and, and muddy shoes. That's yeah. what I do. Mm -hmm. The, the next item is a thumb thing. That's what it's called. What does this thumb and thing do? And what you do with it is you put your thumb into here. Here we have Jesus, his essential wisdom. And what you do with this is you hold it like this, and this way you can read a book. I like that. But can't you just use your thumb? Like, no, because it doesn't work as good. Give like, an example of just your thumb. Here's what your normal thumb is like. It kind of closes. Yeah, yeah. I, I, my thumb is gigantic though. Yeah. So this holds open the pages for you. This way you can read them easily. Unless you have a big thumb like me. We thought it was weird because it's because it, it's not really essential. You don't really need it. It's just. And we couldn't tell what it was. Yeah. yeah. We, whenever we first saw it, we were like, "What the heck is this?" Mm -hmm. But it's not too much of an important item. It's just weird because you're fine without it. You could just hold it, hold it with like your finger right here. Yeah. Yeah, but that's uncomfortable. It is uncomfortable. Or you could just hold it like this. Okay, moving on. Next item we have Ocean Life writing pen. Mm. I really like this. I'm probably gonna bring it. It's an octopus tentacle I've, on a pen. I've had a pen like this before, but it wasn't detailed, and it was all rubbery, so it was, it was very hard to write with. It's green. It's like a hard knife. It's it's, it's kind of weird to hold. Draw pitch. I can draw pitch. Oh, I don't. It's like it's very awkward to hold. It feels like one of those thick elementary school pencils. Also, it's very weird to hold. Oh, that was oh no! The first, oh, oh, this the first, first strike first. is never good. I also do Ooh, like how it feels. I do like this. This is high. Oh, and stuff. like the inside right here. 
It looks like the inside of it. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It's not just like cheaply painted. Landon wants to see it. This is like high quality okay. stuff. All right, so item number five, I think, is this really weird looking stapler that I don't know how to use. So, I don't know how this works. It's a battery it's powered. Uh, okay. Jonah and Noah do. Well, I do. I kind of want to take it apart, but I know I'm not going to be allowed to. It's a battery powered uh, stapler. Yeah, and it looks. And it's like automatic. But it looks cool. It looks like a weird sewing machine. That just puts it out. Yeah, I know. Maybe like put your finger here so you can. Don't, don't buy your stapler. Yeah, I don't want to staple myself. No, that's not the proper way, Jonah. My mom stapled herself once. It's it's like this Wait, paper. Wait, maybe what if you do this? I have an idea. I has an idea. What do you mean flat it's, edge? Does it have to like trigger it? Yes. Oh, yeah. no, it triggered it. It's, Look at that, I triggered it. Now it's simple. It's not, it's not hard enough to do so it. Now it, says on this, the, it literally says on the here. manual it's paid for 14 pages. And now if you go to the middle, you can do it again. We're gonna fold it this way we can staple it good. Yeah, that's probably good enough. I'm staple it. I just stapled yes. Cran's face. <laughs> oh, Cran. So that, yeah. Oh, I my. double stapled it! Oh, no. Ah! Oh, no. You could put this on the top of your locker, and then if you had a bunch of papers from like one class, you could staple them all together. I'm gonna staple it like in some teacher's class or something. And it looks cool, so it'd be a cool decoration. So number seven are these little nose pencil sharpeners. And we have three of them. We have three of them. Seems dangerous. Don't this seems dangerous. Having a sharp. At first, it looks like it's a nose thing. But then you realize it's a. Pencil sharpener. That's all. Sharpen it on up. Sharpen it. The emoji pencil. Yeah, it's like a little pen. Yeah, it's not a good sharpener at all. This is a pretty terrible sharpener. Seems like when you get a gift bag after watching. You have to sharpen until the cows come home. Is that where we? Where have the cows been, Bob? So by now, it should be. It sharpened the wood. The lead is gone. It just disappeared. Does he even have one? Uh. Sharpen the eraser! I used to do that. And then it would get in the middle. Uh, once oh. a kid in my school sharpened his pinky. Uh, Ew. I'm pretty sure at least some people from my old school watch this. So, uh. Hey, there it's we go. Cool. It's so sharp, no. it could. It could kill it's a man. Almost as sharp as my wit. What happened to his pinky? <laughs> Look at how I think sharp it's that is. Okay, so, the next item is a Sonic Bomb Junior Clock. And it's, it's a very loud, loud clock. extra loud vibrating clock. It's a very loud, loud clock that vibrates. Shakes you awake with vibrating bed shaker and adjustable loud alarm. So it can be for deaf people. For deaf people. Yeah. They have vibrating alarms. Adjustable volume and tone, powerful vibrating bed shaker, pulsating alert light. This is a bed shaker. That's <laughs> it. That's it. <laughs> it just vibrates your bed. That's it. And wakes you up. I'm scared of it. Me too. It should go off at 7.02. It's gonna think of like it's Looks gonna... like cover. And if it doesn't, then I said it wrong, but you know. It should be loud. How do I call your phone? That's not bad. Oh. This isn't bad either. This isn't bad either. Your this phone is, so is weak. more. Look at it. Put it on the table oh. and see how it sounds. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> okay, It'll so be fine. That's this, fine. Is, this is very disappointing. And we thought it was going to be much more intense. But it wasn't. I do like how it's pulsating like that, though. Because if it was just constant, then you get used to it. Next item, I am introducing it. Uh, it is little suction cup gum things. Mm. We thought these were magnets, but we ordered the wrong thing. These are actually like drink things that you put on your drink. But they'll, they'll still work item. because they, you can suction cup them like to your locker and stuff. Or like, your water bottle. So you could use these to like put them on your little thermos or something, so then nobody wants it. Because I mean, that's pretty off putting. But I mean, I, who has teeth this small? Nobody, that too. Yeah. I know at a lot of parties, like people mark their drinks with stuff like this. Yes. Like These there's just a bunch of red solo cups. Instead of like sharpening on your name, they just like. But who's gonna see this on your cup? If um, you're having like a school party. But yeah, these a are a party, and you could put like it on a. Yeah. I also like the noise it makes. They're also they could use be used as fidget sticks, but you could put them on your locker too, and I'll probably do that. Oh hi. Hi. She tried to. She held me hostage once. She did. She. she She's mean. She only likes me. So our final weirdest item is Paige. Not Paige, but it is like. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Our tenth and weirdest item is this fish pencil case. It is. And cute. here's why I like it. So first of all, you're looking at it and you're like, that's a fish. And then you open it, and then you're like, that's an inside of a fish. It's pretty Because you would gross. expect it to just be black in there. But no. Oh my goodness, oh. it just goes the whole way. <laughs> wow. Oh. Make it, it all the way inside I can't, out. I can't. It looks like some type of weird snail now. Ew. But it, it's really beautiful. It looks like an organ. Ew! It is. I didn't look at it up close. It's gross. 
So it's just a picture of a dead fish. Give it a kiss. I picked this one out. I'm proud. That's weird. I didn't even know this was one of the items that we had. Wow. I picked out these gum things, but they weren't what I thought. <laughs> so those were all of the 10 items. Comment down below which one you think is the weirdest. Make sure to go check out Paige's channel. Link is in the description. Thank you for watching. Please comment, share, subscribe. Thumbs up. Pause for new and bye, YouTube. Peace out, YouTube. See you next time, YouTube. Okay, thanks. Bye. Oh, click these uh, rectangles to watch my videos and click the circle to subscribe.